Hello friends, welcome to another unforgettable journey through the heart of Switzerland. Today we are exploring the breathtaking landscapes of the Lukmanier Pass, a place where every turn reveals a new breathtaking view. Let's dive into the beauty and wonder of this spectacular region. Welcome back to our channel Wonders of Switzerland. Hey everyone, today we are taking you to an adventure in the beautiful Lucomagno region. Passo del Lucomagno in Italian, also known as Lucmanier Pass, is one of Switzerland's most breathtaking mountain passes. This spectacular pass is more than just a road, it's a gateway to the beauty and diversity of the Swiss landscape. From the charming Blenio Valley in the Italian-speaking canton of Ticino, the road ascends gracefully, guiding you through the serene Medel Valley and finally into the historic municipality of Dicentis in the canton of Grisons. Whether you are here to explore, to hike, or simply to breathe in the crisp alpine air, Lukmanier Pass offers an unforgettable experience. This hidden gem with its stunning vistas make this region a must-visit destination in Switzerland. Today our trip is even more special because we have our friend Gabriela Ova with us. Hello guys! <laughs> we are taking her to know uh, a new place here in Switzerland. Okay, Gabi is a little shy, but she is a very special friend to us. Okay, like right. <laughs> She was our maid of honor at our wedding and she lives in Prague. She has already visited us twice here in Switzerland. All the landscapes and places you pass by while descending the Lukmanier Pass are incredibly beautiful, but we want to highlight a few key spots that are worth stopping for. The first one is the St. Mary's Arch Dam. St. Mary's Lake, nestled just north of the Lukmanier Pass, is a serene alpine lake that captivates with its natural beauty. Spanning the municipalities of Medel in the canton of Guissons, with a small portion extending into Blenio in the canton of Ticino, this reservoir covers a surface area of 1.7 square kilometers. A key feature of this picturesque lake is the St. Mary Arch Dam, a remarkable feat of engineering completed in 1968. As you journey along the Lukmanier Pass, the main road traces the eastern shore of the lake, offering travelers stunning views of this tranquil body of water, set against the backdrop of the Swiss Alps. After visiting the dam, our next stop was the Fimach Waterfall. 
This spectacular natural wonder is a hidden gem that not many know about, making it an insider tip for those exploring the area. The waterfall can now be admired from a newly constructed viewing platform, where a table and a bench are thoughtfully placed, inviting visitors to linger and enjoy a peaceful picnic amidst nature's beauty. The path to the platform is well marked and easy to follow, requiring just a short 5-minute walk making it accessible for everyone who wishes to take in the stunning sight of the waterfall and surrounding landscapes. We were so captivated by the landscapes that we decided to continue our journey down the valley to the Medel region. There we made a stop at the Medellina Hotel to enjoy some ice cream and take a short break. The Medellina Hotel is more than just a place to rest, it's a gateway to unforgettable adventures in the Medel Valley. Perched on the upper edge of the village of Curalia, the Medellina Hotel offers breathtaking views of the village below, the sweeping valley and the majestic surrounding peaks. The Medel region encompasses the 16 km long Medel Valley, a stunning stretch of land that links the upper canton of Grisons with the canton of Ticino. Medel is a small, picturesque community with a population of just 344 people as of December 2020. Over the past decade, the population has seen a decline of about 10%. The area is deeply rooted in its cultural heritage, with most residents speaking Romansh, a local dialect spoken only here in this canton of Switzerland. German is the second most common language, followed by Italian.
on our way back, we made a stop in the Garville of Medel area. We got out of the car and took a leisurely walk down the valley towards the river. As we ventured deeper into the valley, we encountered some of the famous Swiss cows. Their iconic bells echoing through the mountains. The atmosphere here is simply magical. You truly feel like you've stepped into a Tolkien tale, half expecting Frodo and Sam to appear at any moment, cheerfully making their way towards the Shire. As our journey through the Lukmanir Pass comes to an end, we hope you have been as captivated by the beauty of this region as we have. From the serene waters of St. Mary's Lake, to the hidden gems of the Fimach waterfall and the tranquil Meadow Valley, every corner of this landscape tells a story of nature's splendor. Thank you for joining us on this journey. We encourage you to explore these hidden treasures for yourself and create your own unforgettable memories in this enchanting corner of Switzerland. If you enjoyed this journey, don't forget to give us a thumbs up and share your thoughts in the comments below. And of course, make sure to subscribe to our channel for more breathtaking adventures in Switzerland. Hit the notification bell so you never miss a new video. As always, we wish you a safe trip and we see you on our next adventure.